Do you want to know how to make this delicious strawberry coronarita? Well, stay tuned because that's exactly what we're doing on this episode of Forking Around. What's up, thirsty people? Thanks for finding my channel, Forking Around. My name is Sean, and today we're in the Quarantina Cantina making the famous strawberry coronarita. This drink is not only nostalgic, but it tastes great and it's perfect for warm weather drinking. All right, let's talk about what you're gonna need. You're gonna need some lime juice, some triple sec, a Corona, some tequila, some frozen strawberries, some margarita salt to rim your glass, one big ass glass, and a blender. All right, so you're gonna need a big glass for this drink because we're making two drinks in one. If you don't have a big glass like this, maybe use your favorite flower base. Okay, first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna rim our glass with some salt. Simply take one lime wedge and just run it around the rim as you squeeze just lightly. Take your margarita salt. We're just gonna use our cutting board here and spread it out. Now we're just gonna dip our glass right into that salt. And there we go. Once you get your rim blind with salt, simply fill the glass with ice. All right, let's talk about the recipe. First thing we're gonna do, since we're making the strawberry coronarita, is we're gonna put about four to five big strawberries in there, or about half a cup. If you prefer the classic margarita over a strawberry margarita, simply just use half a cup of ice. Next, you're gonna need four ounces of tequila. That's two, and four. Next ingredient is triple sec, two ounces. Last ingredient is lime juice. Two ounces of lime juice. Once you have all the ingredients in there, give it a simple shake. Pop it on your blender. They blend until the strawberries are completely pulverized. Dump the strawberry margarita straight into your glass. You're going to want to let that margarita settle to the bottom before shoving in your Corona. All right, here comes the fun part. We're gonna garnish this margarita with a Corona. What you're gonna to wanna to do is shove this Corona all the way to the bottom or as far as you can get it down. What you're gonna see is the Corona is gonna start coming out, but it'll eventually stop. All right, so take your Corona, shove it all the way down in there, as far as you can get it. You'll see the glass start filling and eventually it'll stop. You're gonna want a straw for this drink. Garnish with a lime. There you have the strawberry coronarita. Let's give it a try. Oh, it's delicious. Mixed with the lime flavor and the corona, tastes perfect. This goes without saying, but this is a strong drink. We have two in one here. So take it slow. Because if you don't, you're going to be all forked up and you're going to be forking around somewhere where you don't want to be. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. Check back in often because we're going to be making drinks like this right here in the Quarantina Cantina all quarantine long. Thanks everyone. See you next time.